good morning. All right, so this is like a last minute thing here. But what we're going to do is how many of you guys know that we're having a New Year's Eve concert here? Anybody? Anybody? Bueller? Bueller? All right. Well, sweet. All right, that was a movie reference in case you guys didn't get it. Um, I play in a band with uh, some of these guys back here, actually. As a matter of fact, these two guys right here. We're a group called Run With Patience, and we are a Christian band. We're going to be playing on New Year's Eve, and we want to invite you guys and kind of preview you guys, give you guys a little bit of a preview of what we're going to be doing. Uh, more than just coming and watching a bunch of guys play instruments and watching a bunch of old guys, you know, relive the glory years or something like that. <laughs> Sorry. I meant me. <laughs> um, you know, I, I feel, I don't know how to explain it. I'm not the best with words, but I really feel like this is an event more than just coming and hearing a bunch of guys playing, but it's a chance to really come and get re-energized for Christ in the new coming year. You know, every year you have people that celebrate they go off and they party, they do different things, and they make resolutions about how to change their life, and we're going to lose weight, we're going to exercise more, we're going to do blankety-blank, I'm going to be a better person. Why not get reconnected with the God who loves you, you know? So this is an event where for me personally, I'll be singing and playing a bunch of original music that we all kind of wrote together. Uh, one of the songs that we're going to do is called More Than a Man, because that's who Jesus is to me. He's more than just a man. I don't know how many times with the places I've been and people that I've talked to, I've heard somebody say, oh, that Jesus was a good guy, but, you know, he's not for me. Hey, you might be a little disappointed when you, <laughs> when you finally pass on. Jesus is more than a man. He overcame so much. For me in my life, some of you guys have heard me talk about some of the issues that I had being, a, being an angry little kid, and he's still working on me, you know. Uh, he came down, and he reached, and he grabbed me and pulled me out of some really, really hostile anger. And for some of you guys, he's reaching down and doing the same thing. And uh, we're going to sing about that as soon as I get this right. <laughs> All right, so the first thing you got to do is get up. <laughs>
if you have friends that don't know Christ, please invite them to come. Please invite them to come and be around people who want to know Jesus and want to recommit their lives to Jesus and worship Jesus at the same time on December 31st. We're going to be right here at Cornerstone. There's going to be a couple other groups there, I believe. There's also going to be a lot of worship, a lot of singing going on. Come on out and join us. Thank <laughs> you.